This was the main building of the Highlander Folk School. Specifically, it's the library building. So it's the one that's in the picture with MLK. It's the one that's in that picture. Exactly. So the purpose of this place is to restore it to just like how it was in 1962. So if we look at number two, analyze different perspectives on the problem, how do different people feel about the problem? So I want to talk about different types of pollutants. So there's three different types of pollutants. Everyone already knows about all the pollution. Is that correct? Yes. yes. Just like this pebble creates ripples in the water, you as an individual member in our community can make a change through your actions. In a few minutes, you're going to throw your, pe your own pebble into the pond. And as you watch the ripples, think of the power of your actions and the ways you can create positive change. When you're ready, you can throw your pebble. Look at what's happening with the ripples. I hope that for all of this today, that you learned a little bit about Highlander Gold School and the history of what has happened in this building. But even more importantly, that we can learn from the legacy of Highlander Gold School and be able to take something with us so that you can make a positive impact, gentlemen, so that you can make a positive impact in your